many dunks tonight? <laughs> well, the one year we thought there was going to be a lot, and boy, guys were kind of selling out to make sure no one did dunk. Yeah. <laughs> Coming back here, folks. It's now about 4:18 left before we start the second game here tonight at the uh, Pepsi 2C All-Star Classic game here. 
Uh, we've got the white team against the blue team. If you're just joining us, the white team defeated the blue team by a score. If I can flip the page back here. White team 74, blue team 58. Top scorers for the blue team was Elsie Williams with 16. For the white team, it was Kira Raines and Destiny Thompson with 18 each. Destiny Thompson come away with the MVP for the girls. Are you there, John? I'm here. So, yeah, really well played game. Uh, boy. Really it was. Uh, yeah, Team Blue came, got out to an early in the first quarter, and then Team White Boy, once they got going, they maintained that double-digit lead for the entirety of the second half. And boy, Team Blue had chances, just could not get it down into, into a manageable number. So, uh, well-played game, uh, highly entertaining. Oh, yeah. So, and we'll see more of the same. I wouldn't be surprised, watching these guys warm up, a lot of shots going in the basket. I would not be surprised to see these teams push 80, maybe even up close to 90 points. Uh, well, the okay. teams used to back in the 80s and the 90s. Well, those guys lived with a basketball yeah, hand, yeah. so <laughs> we'll, we'll see. But again, same as with the girls game, a lot of talent on display tonight. Uh, some guys that will be continuing their careers elsewhere at the next level. So uh, a few more mustaches than I I was just going to mention oh, that earlier. I've seen a few. We're, we're going to call this team, I, team I stash. Know, well, <laughs> they've been maybe watching some Tom Selleck movies. They need to fill in those stashes a little bit more. But uh, Sam Elliott and Tom Selleck, they, you know, they yeah. hard pressed to beat those mustaches. Uh, that's true. That's true. So. Good thing we're not on on the screen that they can tell. Right? Yeah, so. But. Back on school. School's coming to an end here. Yeah, I think we have like 26 school days left, something like that. Yeah, that's so, pretty impressive. Yeah. Yeah, I'm so, good with that. Got a lot of things to get in in those 26 days. Yeah. yeah We've got a few sporting good. events. we got a few uh, um, conferences that they have to go to and uh, that they've been to, too. But, FFA and yep, BPA and so that's pretty that good. good. So anyway, you know more than I do. How many of these kids are going on, seniors are, are going to go on and play at the next level? The only one that I know for sure is Mason Deathman. He's committed to play football for the Bobcats. Right. Uh, the rest of them, I honestly do not know. So... Uh, I would have to ask a little bit. Right. I got to turn it over to you for just a second. Okay. For the white team, they've got uh, three seniors, three juniors, one sophomore, and one freshman playing here. And we've got all the teams covered from the two seed. For the blue team, they've got five seniors and five juniors. So a little more experience on the blue team. And that will be coached by uh, Coach Triplett. And the white team, they'll be coached by Cody Stepler and Grady Gonzorowski. Grady Gonzorowski coming here from the uh, Wilson Tetons to come back to help, te help coach these, te these teams here. So we're going to give everybody the announcement. Here. Yeah, every, pretty near every... Every young man out there has a has a short mustache, so. Man, here we go. Yes, what a game they played. Applause for the people for those. So we got Shriver, Nate, and Lonnie here for the referees. So so for the visitors, they'll be the blue team. We're going to start with the reserves. Number 10, a junior, Zane Pilgrim from the Savage Warriors. Now we have a senior, number 14, Sam Butikofer from the Bainville Bulldogs. Then we have another junior, number 40, from the Savage Warriors, Hunter Sa Sanders. And now for the starters. 
a junior from the Culbertson Cowboys, number two, Bridger Salvador. Then we have another junior from the Mondak Thunder, number three, Thomas Arntzen. We have a senior from the Plentywood Wildcats, number 11, Noah Murray. Uh, another, a junior from another one from the Plentywood Wildcats, number 12, Carson Solberg. And finishing out the roster for the blue team, a senior, Troy Blake, Red Hawk, number 55, Nate Stentoff. Now for the home team, they'll be the white team here tonight. Starting at the top of the list for the reserves. We got a sophomore from the Playwood Wildcats, number four, Landon Flickinger. We have a junior from the Playwood Wildcats again, number seven, Ben Higgin. We have a freshman from the Brockton Warriors, Jared Fasthorse. And now for your starters. A senior, number five, from the hometown RL Fusion, Austin Lean. Then we have a senior from the Bainville Bulldogs, number 12, Charles Buttercofer. Then we have a junior from Plentywood, number 21, Chance Klein. And a junior, number 22, from the Savage Warriors, Sailor Erickson. And finishing out the roster, a senior from the Floyd Lake Redhawks, number 55, Mason Detman. Coaches are Cody Stepler and Grady Gonzaroski. Bill Triplett for the blue team. I'm going to go on a limb here and say that uh, Mason Deathman wins the tip. <laughs> okay. No offense to Bridger Salvold, but... Uh, Salvold to jump uh, for the... Yeah, the only way Mason loses this if he's, is if he decides that he doesn't want to win it. Yeah. And he did! <laughs> well, Salvold had a shot at it. White team's shot up no good. Rebound comes yeah, down. Salvador with it. He loses it to Deathman. Deathman ahead to Klein. Shot up no good. Rebound to Arnson. Boy, quickly we got uh, two missed layups. Arnson with it into the front court. Hands out for Solberg. He's guarded by Deathman, so I think the tallest guy on the shortest guy. Salvavold with it. He thought about a three. He's going to drive on Erickson. Layup up and good. So 0 for 2 for Team White, 1 for 1 for Team Blue, and it's 2 nothing. And it looks like we're going two 20 minute halves here instead of oh, four 10 minute okay. quarters. Detman not to Klein. Klein, top of the key, three point shot, no good. Rebound picked up by Rudikofer, put back up and in. Stentoff had a chance at it, didn't get it. Arson into Stentoff. Over to Solberg, he's picked up by Lean. Thought about the three, good closeout by Lean. Arnson will take the three, and that is good. Boy, Arnson had all kinds of time, he even kind of hesitated slow motion into that. But uh, another made shot for Team Blue. There's beautiful for now. Dribbles over to Erickson on the right side. Now Detman, top of the key, three point shot and in, good. Yeah, a little grin that Hank Salvo was like, hey, you know, I'll let you shoot it. Probably not a good idea, but Arnson quick crossover on Klein, but gets cut off by Lean. Hands it over to Stentoff, crosses over on Budico for a lip. Well, he kicks it back out to Sober, corner three, just off back iron. Salvo with the rebound, put up by Lean, no good. good Klein with the rebound. Austin Lean. Outlet pass gets over to Erickson. Now Klein, Detman, looks underneath Budikofer. Budikofer low post, step underneath, deflected, gets his own rebound, put back up and in for two. Well, that was a good attempt there by Murray to alter that shot. Quickly up ahead, Murray gets it from Solberg, gets it back to Solberg. Carson over to Thomas Arnson, back to Stentoff in the corner. Thought about it, fakes it, takes the three, and that's long again, hesitation causing the missed shot. Rebound outlet to Lean, now pass underneath to Detman. Detman gets control, loses it, and he goes to the line for two. Yeah, boy, you can already see the pace of the game and how quick these guys are up and down. I mean, you really have to be on your toes. 7-5 here in the early going, Team White with the lead. Detman's first shot is up and in. Foul is against Murray. A one more for Detman. Shot up and in. Salvador the inbound gets it to Stentoff. Trailing by four. 
They had the quick 5-2 lead. Stentoff on the drive gives it to Salvavold. He's helped by Klein. Good strong take. Left it a little hard off the backboard. Detman now on the right side. Way across court. Now underneath the Klein. Now Detman. Detman wide open. Goes up against two. Up no good. Lean. Lean with the put back. Detman knocked out of bounds. Beautiful for put back in and good for two. Well, Detman tried to one hand tip and he got knocked out. But third opportunity for Team White and they score. Arnson with it. Boy just about over the back there. Salvable on the drive. His shot up no good. Boy no rebounds. Team White controlling the boards here in the early going. Rebound Erickson. Gets it over to Klein on the left side. Back to Erickson, top of the keep. Erickson, Detman, right wing. Drives into the paint. Bump shot up, no good. Rebound. Beautiful for back up in the end. Yeah, that's, that's tough for Team Blue there. Arnson, boy, giving up a lot of size and length to Budakofer. And, boy, again, missed, missed first opportunity. Offensive rebound, put back. And uh, right now an 11-0 run for Team White as Silver gets up to Salvavold. Looking for a little help, gets to Arnson again, wide open. He thinks about it, left it short. Rebound to Stentoff, no good. And boy, Klein, out left can't to Erickson. buy a basket right now if you're Team Blue. Erickson gets it to Klein at the top of the key over the left side is Budakofer. Charles, Charles goes up and it's deflected by. Great defense by Arnson. Oh, great. Stayed right with it, kept the arm straight up and just got the deflection. Hands off to Stentoff. Gets it to Salvavold. His three from the top of the key is no good. And no blue jerseys <laughs> at all for a rebound there. Here's Detman, top of the key. Three-point shot is swoosh. Boy, and he is on fire. Showing why he was the best player in the district this year. You just can't give him any space at all. Arson with it, guarded by Lean. Murray with it. He's going to hand off to Solberg. Solberg gets the screen from Salvavold. Tries to drive on Murray, can't get there. Now he gets through, layup is up, no good. He'll draw a little contact against his teammates. Is that's gonna be Klein who picks up the foul. Sorry, not Klein. Murray that picks up the foul, excuse me. Thank you. Free throw up and good for Solberg. Solberg. And mass substitutions as you see Murray, Salvable, and Stentoff take a seat. Pilgrim and Sanders and Budakofer in for Team Blue. Second free throw is up, left it short. Rebound to Sanders. Gets it over to Budakofer, and that two is up and good. So three point trip for Team Blue. We'll get back within eight. Fast horse on the right side, shot up, no good. Rebound by Hagen. Gets it Flickinger. Detman on the right wing. Three point, no good. Rebound by S Charles. Yeah, Budico for Charles Budico with a rebound. And then finally Sanders gets out. Pilgrim with it. Gives over to Arnson. Over to Solberg. Fakes the three. Bounces back out. Three on the way is no good. And Detman there for the rebound. Detman looks down. Bring, keeps it there. Over to Charles. Charles back to Detman. Detman left side, down to the left baseline. Cross court pass to Frickinger. Frickinger's three point shot is no good. Rebound, fought for, picked up by. Sanders, a good job of, Arnson got in there and tipped that out. When Hagen with a great hustle play. Gets it to Budico for a layup, no good. And Arnson with another rebound, boy. Thomas Arnson <laughs> playing a lot bigger than his size. Why, just a bad decision there. Tried to fuck Samuel Budico for. And up to Charles, up and in for I two. I guess we'll count that as a dunk. Uh, okay. <laughs> he, his hand touched rim. Pilgrim with it in. Budico for Mr. Leia. Pilgrim with the rebound. Pilgrim Boy, going to the line for two. Yeah, Samuel Budico for had a wide open layup, left it long. Zane Pilgrim did a great job of following that shot. He missed it, but he's gonna draw contact. And that foul's gonna be on number four. Flickinger. Flickinger, so second foul on Team White. First free throw, I don't know sure. that it hit anything. Yeah, it did, it hit the front rim. Did it hit the front of the rim? Yeah, we'll give him that. That's what you say, weight room, young man. Gotta yeah. get the ball all the way there. <laughs> second free throw is up, that one a lot better looking. Still miss, Sanders rebound. Left it short, Budakofer up, gets blocked by his brother. 
So saving a block by Charles. Down court pass, oh, the fast well, horse pass. up and in for two. Boy, Declan tried to that through beautifully. Oh, wonderful. Sammy Budokofer with it, hands out to Pilgrim. Picked up by Flickinger, Pilgrim on the drive, gives back to Budokol for three on the way, no good. Why Sanders <laughs> got away the push. <laughs> He's going to get the basket of up. Boy, Hank is looking around like, did anyone not see me get two hands shoved? <laughs> Uh, Sanders with the basket and the ball. You see Haggett talking to the official. He's like, hey, like I was standing there. I'm not a small guy. So Sanders with a chance for a three-point play. Free throws up, no good. Hagen gets the rebound this time. Over to the right side, fast horse. Three-point shot is up and in for two, three. Uh, nice looking shot from Jared. Fast horse and wait, quick answer. 23-10 is your score. As Arnson dribbles up into the front court, gives it to Pilgrim. Driving on Flickinger, can't get free. Solberg with it. Give and go with Budakofer, boy, he lost it, and Hagen had his hand in there. So we got a couple subs coming in. Stentov coming in for Arnson, and looks like Erickson is coming in for Budakofer on the white team. Giving Charles a break. So Solberg to inbound it. Gets it over. It's Budokov for a quick three on the way. is short. Erickson now with the ball. Comes across. Gets it to the paint. Shot up. No good. Yeah, rebounded by Sammy Budokov for Stantov looking to run. One on two. Crosses over on Flickinger. Great defense by Flickinger. Put back by Budokov. Budokov for yeah. Boy, good job of crashing the boards. Detman on the right side, three point, in and out. Boy, it looks good when left his hand. Stentoff with it, went up and down we go. This is a fast pace. Stentoff hands off to Sanders, tough to get picked up by Hagen. Solberg just about had it stolen by Deathman. He'll hand off to Stentoff who bobbled it. Solberg pump fake the three, uses the screen. Long two on the way is good. And Carson Solberg, Solberg got his feet set and knocked it down. 23-14. 12.20 to go here in the first half. Fast horse now, gets it over to Detman. Detman sees a lane wide open and he knocked out of bounds. Actually, Last touch by Detman. Yeah, I think Detman was hoping <laughs> to get the dunk there. You see him take the big steps and Sanders just, whether he got hand or right, you see Detman smiling and looks at Mr. Swigert saying, hey, I think I got hit there. But Sanders will take a seat and no Wrong hurry back in. Detman's out. So Stentov here, a chance to cut into this nine point lead. Gives over to Solberg into Budokofer. Nice move, but he left it short. Boy, Budokofer made a great spin and just didn't get it high, up, high enough up off the rim. Erickson, fast horse on the left side. Now Erickson. Hagen steps in. Long two, up and in for two. Hey, <laughs> boy, the grin there. Step, <laughs> hesitate, long two. Oh, Budokofer with it, right dribble between the legs, loses it for a second, gives it to Murray. Murray on the drive, cut up by Hagen. Hands off to Stentoff, takes the drive, floater up, no good, rebound to Klein. Klein holding in the backcourt, gets it up to Flickinger. Flickinger on the left side, brings it back to center court. Hands up, hands off to Fast Horse on the right wing. Fast Horse moves around. Now Erickson, top of the key. Drives in, low post, shot up, and good for two. Oh, I love the fundamentals there. Shot fake, pass fake, gets his feet set under and makes it. And up ahead, it's gonna be Murray. Boy, good transition offense from Team Blue. Stentoff found Murray for the layup. 27-16, 11 minutes to go. Erickson, Flickinger on the right side. Now to Klein. Klein hands off to Hagen. Hagen tries to go underneath. Yeah, good Deflected. read by Murray again. And Budakov with it gives up to Pilgrim. Pilgrim's left hand layup up and good. So transition offense for Team Blue cutting into this lead. Yeah, looks like Burger yep. Salvable getting ready to check back in for Team Blue. Erickson has it stripped Strip by that. Stentoff. Stentoff threads the needle, gets it over to the right side. Oh, Murray's drive blocked by Klein, so. Teammates from Plentywood, Noah Murray gets swatted by Chance Klein, and boy, Murray's coming up holding his arm, so we'll, oh, there's gonna be a foul against a 21, foul foul. that's against Chance Klein. Well, I thought that block was gonna be clean, but he must've hit him with the body, so Murray for two. 
Salvable ready to check in. Budakofer and Lean ready to check in. First free throw up, no good for Murray. Salvable in for Carson Solberg and mass substitutions for Team White. Budakofer, Lean, and Deathman in. Hagen, fast horse, and I did not get the last one before he sat down <laughs> out for Team White. Second free throw is up, and that one is also short from Murray. Here's Budakofer. Charles gets it over to Flickinger on the right side. Charles, left side, Klein. Now to Detman, top of the key, guarded by Salvold. Klein drives in, goes up, shot, no good. Put back by Detman is in. Well, you see, Klein was thinking about throwing down the dunk, too, and <laughs> Salvold met him straight up. You get verticality, you can mm -hmm. go straight up. And, boy, that stopped Klein right in his tracks. Good follow by Detman, though. Very good. Murray with it in the left corner. Zane Pilger made a great cut to the basket. Couldn't get to him. Three on the way. And that's Budakofer. That was Sam. Sam and Budakofer with a three-pointer to draw them within eight. Now Flickinger now. He's got it by Stantoff. Over to the right side is Charles. Goes into Lean. Lean. Bounce pass out to Flickinger on the left side. Gets it to Detman. Detman on the left side. Flickinger left side. Three-point shot is away and in. For yeah, and you can't leave Landon Flickinger open. He no. will make you pay. One of no. the best shooters That's in the That's one of the 5'8 five, five five sophomore. Yeah, yeah, he's got a bright future at him. Already one of the better shooters in the division. So Stentoff with it, looking to drive. Left-hand shot was altered. <laughs> and, yeah, I think it's a good call. Ball bounced off of Budakofer's head. Yes. So, yeah, Sammy Budakofer tried to get that rebound off the block shot. So... Blue had drawn within eight, but the three from Flickinger opens back up an 11-point lead. Here comes Detman. Top of the key, dribbles left, layup, up and in for two. Well, and Salvo will play good defense on that. You just can't really stop that. It's 6'5". And speed. Long arms and just got a little bit of space. Sent off over to Salvable. He's going to drive on Lean, pump fakes it, oh. and Lean Good. just took it from him. Boy, great <laughs> defensive play from Lean. Well, he Salvo presented it to him and he took it. Salvo is not a small guy, and Lean playing no. right on the floor. Sanders coming in for Pilgrim. A little more size for we'll Team We'll see if Blue. Sanders goes up against Lean. And Erickson, Sayer Erickson coming in for Flickinger. A little more size out there now. So Team Blue looking inbound here up to Salvable. Hands off to Stentoff, guarded by Budico for three on the way is good. But you don't want to give too many shooters a straightaway three from the top of the key. And back to a 10 point lead here, 34-24. Klein into lean, lean at the low post and it's rejected by Hunter. Yeah, Sanders with a great play. Murray was up ahead and lost the handle. And Stentoff. Oh, they're going to give the timeout to Team White Boy. Stendhal made that oh. play. <laughs> <laughs> More football, and, but... <laughs> right, yeah, there was, a, there was a partial tackle there. Uh, again, one of those, we, uh, we grin a little bit. <laughs> the, uh, the officials grinning, the yeah. triple grinning. You know, again, this all-star game, you're going to see some stuff, you're going to see some smiles. And yeah. Some plays. If regular season, you might get a little hotter about it. <laughs> So, Coach Tripley giving, giving Mr. Creek the business here. He wanted that possession here. Team Blue trailing by 10. 34 to 24. It's going to be Team White, though, with possession. A smart timeout, oh, very, controversial very, well, timeout by yep, Coach yep. Stepler. Either way, he got it. Yeah, that's right. Okay, here comes Detman now for the White team. Detman comes up to the top of the key. Decides to take the shot up and in for three. By double screen and nobody stepped out on defense and that's too easy. Noah Murray with it. Between the legs, hands off to Budakofer. His drive to the basket blocked oh. by Lean, but they're gonna get Lean for the foul. Well, good strong take from Budakofer, but uh, Lean says you're gonna have to earn it the hard <laughs> way. So two free throws coming for Charles Budakofer, sorry, for Samuel Budakofer. First one on the way, that one is good. One more coming for Budakofer. 37-25 as Arnson gets ready to check back in. 
Second one on the way. That one rolls around and in. Boy, Budakolber <laughs> gets all of the iron on that one, but it does go. He'll take a break. Now the ball comes into Detman. Detman, top of the key. Steps back, three point shot is up and in. And when you're feeling it, you're feeling it. And guys are smiling. I mean, there's just not much you can do on that. Arnson gets it up to Murray over to Salvavold. His drive cut up by Lean. Gets it to Stanoff, who lost it for a second and then drops it out of bounds. Boy, sure looked like he dropped it, but I guess they say Budakofer got a hand on it. So Charles knocks it out of bounds. It'll stay blue basketball. Boy, a lot of trouble tying sneakers. Didn't see that in the girls' game, but this is already the second time we got some boys. Have they not heard of double knotting? <laughs> <laughs> Always so, double knotted. Hey, Stentoff with it. Throws it back to Murray. It's a screen, denies the screen from Stentoff. Gets it over to Salvable. His drive cut off. Float up, no good. Good defense by Lean. Detman now with the rebound. Pushing it back up. Into the paint. Dumped into Lean, no good. Put back. Rejected. Oh, nice block right. by Hunter Sanders. It was a great pass from Deathman. Sanders got lead in the first time, but then it was Thomas Arnson who comes from the weak side and completely destroys Lean on that second chance. So some subs coming in. Carson Solberg back in for Team Blue. And it looks like Fast Horse, Hagen, Flickinger. and Flickinger back in for Team White. 7-18 left in the first half. Stentoff with it, dribbles top of the key. He's guarded by Fast Horse, hands off to Solberg. He lost it, we might see a see dunk here. Deathman, boy! Just a nice layup. Yeah, Solberg hustled back and didn't give him the space. Deathman wanted it. <laughs> give and go from Stentoff and Sanders, and Stentoff can't handle it. So another turnover, Team Blue, and kind of like we saw in the first game, Team White got out to a double-digit lead and then kind of coasted. Just kind of stayed there, yes. 42-26, just under seven, go red line, three is good! And Nate Stanhoff just kind of turns and looks and says, I mean, what are you gonna do? <laughs> and Wallace where you're like, you know what, I enjoyed playing with that guy, yes. not so much against him. <laughs> so, Murray with it, fakes the handoff, kicks it back to Stantoff, top the key, his three on the way is good. Anything you do, I can do just as good, yes. just from a little closer. Here comes Erickson now for the white. Hagman, Hagen, gets it to Flickinger. Flickinger, pass underneath the fast horse, over to the left side is Detman. Detman, held up, not a fast horse. Fast horse drives to the free throw line, shot, short. Detman with the rebound, pulls it back out, gets it to Flickinger on the right wing. Yeah, he shuffled Flickinger kind of spit he off did, there. Yeah. He shuffled those feet before he put the ball in. Great call by our official. We'll give them a little bit of love on, on that one. Great, great call there. And much needed stop for Team Blue as it's 45-29. Stentop gets it to Solberg. Back to Stantop. He'll take another one. That's going to be short. Well, you see it was short when he let it go. Detman now. Bounce pass ahead. The fast horse. His layup is up and in for two. Yeah, so I mean, Stantop, or uh, Deathman not only scoring, but dishing it out. Two, that's his third assist. Solberg corner three. That's Whoa, good. rattled right in. Well, I tell you, we, we might see it. It's 47 points for Team Blue with five and a half to go. It's feasible they could hit 60 in the half. Over to Hagen. Boy, Deathman trying to post up. And, boy, long shot out of bounds. Don't come into the game for the blue team. Uh, he's coming in for Sanders. So, uh, Team Blue needs to send someone back to inbounds. Sanders had, a, Sanders had a knee injury during the tournament. He did, yeah. And he I see he's back. Divisionals. Okay, right side, shot up, short. That rebound to Erickson. Erickson will bring it up now. Now fast horse on the left wing. Inside to Detman. Turn around, shot up and in for two. Boy, they stand up, just getting a little frustrated. We played that about as good as you could, and Detman faded away a la Dirk Nowitzki, and there's just nothing you can do. You're giving up six inches, and then the guy fades on you. So Stentoff guarded by Detman. He'll give it up to Arnson, guarded by fast horse. Arnson hands off to Pilgrim, picks up his dribble. Find some help from Murray, guarded by Erickson. Murray looking to drive. 
Boy, good spin move. Nice move. Kept his pivot foot down and used his length to get by Erickson. 49 to 34 is your score. Here's Frickinger. Erickson, top of the key now. Erickson hands off to Detman. Free throw line shot up short this time. Picked up by Solberg. Yeah, I don't think anyone on the white team thought if Detman's shooting, they don't need to rebound. Solberg coast to coast. Nice move. They just assumed it was in. It was all blue jerseys on the rebounds. So 49-36, blue team trying to inch back into it here with four minutes to go before halftime. Now Frickinger gives it to Detman. Detman, turnaround, spin move, goes underneath to Hagen. Boy, nice Lay pass. Lay up and in for two. A great catch by Hagen. Boy, that's, that pass nice is move. fired in there and a great pass from Mason Detman. Sent up with it over to Solberg. Well, he got Flickinger on the pump fake. Didn't take the shot, though. Murray thought about the long one. Said he's going to drive it, passed in, and boy, just didn't get the angle. Thought he got fouled, but uh, looked pretty good defense from there. Flickinger. Detman Flickinger underneath the bucket. <laughs> that was <laughs> the smallest man down. out there, and he tries to do a big man job, and he did all right. That so. goes against Arntzen. It looks like we got Budico for ready to check in for Murray. So, boy, up and down we've gone in a high scoring affair here. First shot up and in for Frickin' Dirt. So, Budokoffer does check in for Murray. So, it'll be Samuel Budokoffer checking in. One more shot coming for Flickinger. Shot is up and good. So, Pilgrim into Stentoff. Stentoff bringing it into the front court. Guarded by Deathman. Hands off to Budakofer. He'll take the three. That's off, no good. Off to the right side. Now fast horse. Gives it to Deathman. Down court to Erickson. Erickson drives the baseline on the left side. Shots rejected by Pilgrim. Boy, and Pilgrim thought he got his teammate there. A <laughs> little bit of contact with the body, but boy, a lot of, lot of ball up top. So Erickson will go to the line. Pilgrim with the foul. First free throw missed by Erickson. Looks like we got Charles Budico for Austin Lean and Chance Klein. Well, Klein's going for the shooter. Hagen's coming off. Flickinger coming off. And if Erickson can make this free throw, this is where, since it's an all-star game, you don't want to come out, you miss the free throw. <laughs> you can't sub on the miss. Right. So. That, In and out. Mean, he must have heard me. <laughs> Pilgrim wasn't gets it ahead to Solberg. And he pump fakes, then takes the three. Boy, Lean bothered it just a second. Detman with the rebound. Detman, a head pass to Lean. Layups, no good. Detman gets the rebound. Goes right, to the was a pretty pass. That now Detman, three point from the side. No good. We got a foul. Oh. And that's the one you want to go in and chance for the four point play. And Stentop was like, I was this close to a swat. And that's one where he's like, man, if I got him, I'd have bragging rights. Why, they called the foul on 55, and I don't think that's correct. 55, oh no, it's Nate Stendhal is 55. Yep, There's right. two 55s. I didn't see that one earlier. <laughs> Guess the teammates wanted to have the same number. First free throw up and good for Mason Deathman. Because they're approaching 60 points here in the first half. Second, Second one also one's good. good. He yeah. just kind of threw that up. <laughs> You know, he has been passing to guys for open shots, but you'll wonder, he's taking awful lot of shots. Is he pushing for 40 tonight? Oh, did he, shoot? he shot that one left-handed, I think. Yeah, he did. And he's a right-handed guy. Right? Stantop with it up to Pilgrim. His drive, oh, oh stripped stop. by Erickson. Erickson on the run. He's going to go up. And oh, there's no. a dunk oh, by Deathman. I don't know that Erickson meant to miss the layup. <laughs> no. But Deathman was right there. Follow up. That's Great the Great dunk. Those are the kind of dunks you want to see. Arnson took a dribble, thought about the three. Solberg guarded by Lean. He's going to drive Lean. Reverse oh. layup, no good. Boy, Pilgrim was there. And I don't know what Lean's arguing. He fouled Solberg. That was an easy call for the official. But if you're Solberg, you better make these because Pilgrim <laughs> followed it up with a made layup. So Lean's second foul. And first free throw, no good. So Solberg saying maybe you shouldn't have called the foul. 
One more on the way for Solberg is up and good. 57-37 here. We've still got two and a half to go before halftime. Lean underneath the bucket. Get Butico for up and in for two. A good pump fake from Lean. Uses the backboard textbook play and a chance for 60. Salvable getting ready to check back in as is Sanders. Shot up off the back of the iron. No good and so Stentoff with it. White sitting on 69 points. Arnson with it. Looking to drive on Budakofer. Gets it instead to Pilgrim. Pilgrim guarded by Klein. Hands off to Arnson. Over to Budico for long three. That's going to be way long. Rebounded to Deathman. Deathman on the run. Bounce pass over to the right side is Erickson. Back over to Lee. Knocked out of bounds. And well, who are they going to call it off? I think they're going to keep it with Team White. So Pilgrim and Solberg take a seat. South Fulton Sanders in. 157 to go here in the first half. 59-37. Budukofer gets it into Lean. His short jumper's up and good. So Austin Lean with another basket. And steal by Budukofer. Boy, Arson, not sure what he was doing. He was passing it under the basket and tried to throw over Budukofer. And an unforced turnover. Salvavo with it. His shot up and left it short. Rebound to Sanders. Taken away by Budukofer. Charles now over to Detman on the left wing. Guarded by Salvavo. Shot up short. Rebound, lean. Back to Klein on the left wing. Shot is away and good for three. Wait, that was an interesting little shot from kind of hunched over <laughs> and kind of flicked it up and in. But hey, as long as it goes in, and uh, with a minute 15 to go, Team White chance for 70 here. Stand off three, misses everything but the backboard up ahead to Erickson. Erickson cut off, makes a shot from the right side. No good. Halfway down. One minute to play here. Stand off coming up with it. Picked up by Erickson, Stentoff's run, boy, he got, oh, there you go. oh, he got a hand in the back, he got a little help moving there. And we're going to go the other way, Team White with Detman with 29 points so but far. 66, how many, 29? 29, yeah. 29, there you go. Erickson now on the left side. Left wing shot up and in for three. Oh, three. oh and giving it to his teammate Sanders. Put up the three fingers there. Budakofer with it. There's Deathman. Is he going to dunk on his teammate? Yes, yes he, he is. is. I'm going to credit Stentoff right there. Nate Stentoff could have played defense instead. He let his teammate have the dunk. Great unselfish play. A little, uh, little NBA <laughs> all-star <laughs> defense right there. And uh, with that dunk, Deathman goes over 30 in the first half. And Team White goes over 70. And they have the ball with 33 seconds left. They're going to call off the shot clock. I think they're leaving points. Oh, no. oh, no. oh, they are going to take it off. So Erickson with it. Will they hold for the last shot or will they see if they can get it to 75 before halftime? Gives it to Deathman. He's had the hot hand here. Back to Erickson. Boy, Budakofer just about came up with the steal. Are we going yep. ISO? No, he's, oh, he's not going to take the screen from Klein. Deathman has it tipped away. Arnson now with the ball on the right side. Going against Budakofer. Shot up. No good. Uh, Budakofer, <laughs> boy, he took a healthy swing at that. I tell you what, if he had contacted just ball, there was a couple of people in that front row that were going to be losing teeth. Yeah, that's right. Arnson at the line now for two. I mean, if you're going to go for it, go big. And, uh, Budakofer took, I mean, that was a, I mean, that was like a Barry Bond swing with a bat. <laughs> Arnson up with the first one, no oh, good. Uh, common theme here, the blue team getting to the free throw line but not making them. Hope we're keeping this enjoyable for you folks. <laughs> <laughs> it's been entertaining to say the least. Arnson's is. second one on the way is also no good. Also played by Sanders, throws it away. Go to by Bruno Koffer, he tries a shot, hits the ceiling and then that's going to be the end of the first half. All right, I'm not sure what Budico was doing. He still he let it go with over a second to go. He could have taken two more dribbles. But uh, your score at the end of one half, and I kid you not, 71 to 37. Uh, we were thinking maybe <laughs> someone gets to 90 at this rate. They might get to 130. So yeah, they might slow it down. Yeah, you know, I don't. Th I think they're just going to keep going for it. I, Why, so. I mean, it's, I mean they're it's doing it. For fun. They're just 
Listen, the, the blue team's getting shots. They're just not making them. That's right. So, I mean, I don't know what the shooting percentage is, but I would guess that Team White's shooting close to 60, yes. if not higher, and Team Blue's shooting about 25 to 30. Yep, yep, that's so. it. That, that's the way it looks. So, well, we'll give you some rough stats here for the first half. We'll start with the blue team. Bridger Salvador has no fouls. He has one field goal for two points. And we have Thomas Arntzen from the Mondock Thunder. One foul, one field goal. 0 for 2 from the Charity Stripes. That gives him two. Savage Warrior Zane Pilgrim. One foul, 0 for 2 from the Charity Stripe. One field goal, two points. Plentywood Wildcat, Noah Murray. He's got one foul. He's got two field goals. 0 for 2 from the Charity Stripe. That gives him four. Carson Solberg. The Playwood Wildcat, senior. He's got two for four from the Charity Stripe. He has two field goals and one three-pointer. So that gives him nine. Samuel, Buti Samuel Butikofer from Bainville. He has one foul. He's got two field goals, one three-pointer, two for two from the charity stripe. Nine points for Sam. Now Hunter Sanders from the Savage Warriors. He has one field goal over one from the charity stripe. That gives him two. Nate Stentoff, two three-pointers, six points. So that should add up to 37. I'm not gonna do it. <laughs> now for the white team, with the lead, Landon Frickinger, two fouls, one three-pointer, two for two from the charity stripe. Say, while you're sitting there, John, mm -hmm. figure out how many free, missed free throws that the blue team has got, and we'll work on that later. Anyway, Landon Frickinger from the Plentywood Wildcats has one three-pointer and two field goal, two attempts at the free throw line for two each. That gives him five points. Four for 13, the blue team is. And Austin Lean, the RL Fusion hometown boy here. He's got two fouls. He's got two field goals. 0 for 1 from the charity stripe. That gives him four. Ben Hagen from the Plentywood Wildcats. He's got no fouls. He's two field goals. That gives him four. Jared Fasthorse from the Rockton Warriors. Two field goals. One three-pointer. It's for seven. Charles Butikofer from the Bainville Bulldogs. He's got five field goals, so that gives him 10. Chance Klein has two, field, two fouls, one field goal, one three-pointer, that gives him five. Sarah Erickson, no fouls, one field goal, one three-pointer, 0 for two from the charity stripe, that gives him five. Then we get down to Mason Detman. He's got one, two, three, four, five, five three-pointers. He's got two, three, four, five, six field goals. He is four for five from the free throw line. That gives him 31 points for the first half. Is he going to keep going or is he going to? You know, I wouldn't be surprised if knowing how these guys respect him and this is last game and again it's an all-star game it's not that it doesn't mean anything because it does right. mean something they're out here playing they're having a good time right. i wouldn't be surprised if they don't say hey go for 50. Yeah. i mean it's one of those things where when a, when a guy's having a night like that i mean yeah. this is a memory I mean, it's like when i was playing baseball in high school yeah. and we had a guy that threw no hitters and you did everything you could to make sure that there wasn't a hit. Yeah, yeah. Right? Same with like a shutout. You're yep. going to lay out, you're going to do everything you can because it's not about you, it's about your teammate. And you'll always remember, hey, I was there that but night. That, that's right. Right? So. And they're not uh, just giving it to him. Huh? Oh, no. Oh, they're, they're making, making him work. work. They're making him work for it. Only one, and, only one, that one layup there yep. that they, they let him have because yep. that would have just been a wreck. Right. Well, and. He's been passing both. He's got it. Oh, yes. Five assists. Yes. So it's not that he hasn't passed the ball. Uh, he he just is. I mean, he's a special talent. Right. Uh, That's for, right. For our district, he's a generational talent. That's right. You're, That's you're right. You're gonna go a long ways before you see another player with his skill level That's right. come through. That's right. And so 
you, you tip your cap to them. You enjoy the fact that you got to play against them. Yep. You know, I, I go back to when I was in high school playing against guys like Nick Disley and Casey Durham. Oh, yeah. Four-year starters for the Bobcats. You always remember, hey, I played against those guys. Didn't win against them. That's right. But you respect that competition. That's and right. So that's what all these guys get to do tonight. I'm going to say something to Grady. Uh, you go right ahead there. But no, the teams are doing good here. We'll, we'll see where they go. Um, I'm not saying the writing's on the wall, but it's... The blue team could bring it back if if things were, were to happen. So they didn't bring us pizza, right? <laughs> yeah, you know, it's okay. <laughs> I ate before I came. Ah, uh, so did I. So, well, I put our, the our in uh, Coach Gonzalez's uh, ear. Our, our time here is is for you folks. So that's why we're we'll sacrifice our supper. <laughs> yeah. Well. I did. I put the bug in Coach Gonzaroski's ear. He was not aware. He kind of got wide-eyed when I said the Mason had 31 already. I said, yeah. maybe maybe he goes for 50. Uh, you know, so we'll see. Yeah. But uh, uh, either way, I mean, I saw Nate Stendhal on the one. <laughs> he just kind of turned and looked at him and was like, really? Really, guy? You're going to do, do that to me? And, hey, you know, when you're feeling it, you're feeling it. That's so. right. That's right. <laughs> They've played in enough practices together yeah. that they know – when one is on and where it's going to go. Well, and, you know, for the blue team here, you come out in the second half and you should be feeling pretty loose because, listen, it I know someone would disagree with me, but it really can't get any worse. You're down 34. Without Detman, it, it would, would be, be a, a two-point game. Yeah, it would be 37-31 blue team if it was just Mason. Yeah. Um, well, so well, you take Detman out. Right. And uh, the blue team would, or the white team would be ahead by uh, three points. You take 31 oh. points from oh, yeah. of Deathman exactly. away from the 71. Right. I think if you just had Deathman score yeah. versus the other one. Right. right. You're right. 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 Yeah. So, yeah. That's crazy. <laughs> it is. It is. So, well. but it's great to have all the all the people here tonight. We've got a great crowd. Yes, we do. Beautiful weather out there. Hope all the cows are holding together. Very nice. Can't, can't complain about what we've had the last little bit. That's right. That's right. That's right. So, well, we're just about ready for the tip-off second half. And uh, I don't know what you think. we got a 20-minute half. How long before <laughs> we hit 100? Oh, well, uh, maybe by the half of it. Okay. By 10-minute so. mark. Okay. I'm good with that prediction. All right. Yeah, we're out, out here, folks, from the cities and the farms to the, and the barns. We're here to give you folks the action. So we've got the voices for radio. We don't have the faces. <laughs> yeah, that's probably fair. Oh, okay, okay, okay. All right, so it looks like we've got for Team White, we're going to go Lean, Deathman, Klein, Budakofer, and Erickson. And for Team Blue, Pilgrim, Solberg, Stentoff, Sanders, and Murray. And wouldn't you know it, uh, well, I thought there it is going to be Team White Ball. So yep. they uh, they start the half up 34 points, and they start with the ball. Well, I do have to tell you, Noah, kid asked his dad if he knew what the happens during an eclipse. And the father replied, no son. <laughs> <laughs> I saw that. Man. <laughs> Thank you. Detman now with the ball. Double teamed him over to Butikofer. Now back to Erickson. Erickson dribbles over to the left side, down to the left baseline. Boy, a lot now of climb. defense from Blue. Boy, they're, they're, it's almost like come out on a mission here. Don't let anybody score. Detman on the right side. He's picked up. Bounce pass underneath the Klein over to Lean. Lean's going to muscle up against Hunter. And it's up and in for two. Yeah, good footwork by Lean. Good patience from Team White. Pilgrim with it. Boy, Solberg hit the ground, and Erickson got over and blocked Pilgrim, but Sanders gets it back. <laughs> Pilgrim to Sanders by playing a little two-man game at the expense of Budico for there. He couldn't quite cover both of them. There, Detman on the right-hand side. Three-point shot is away. Short. Lean now. Gets it to Erickson. He's going to try the three, and it's in. 
Boy, well, picking up right where they left off, uh, just raining buckets. If they miss the first one, they get offensive rebound. Sanders, sorry, that's Murray, Murray yeah. with the three. So, again, much like the girls' game, starting off hot in the second half. Lots of points. Uh, uh, Murray, Murray. Murray. <laughs> That's why we're here. We work with our, with our competition. Adesson on the rebound. Tried to dunk it. Missed again. Boy. Klein with the beam. Rebound. Yeah, Deathman tried for the putback dunk there. He's 0 for 3 to start the second half. Maybe a little bit of pressure to get to that 50. Boy, and Lean thought that someone had the rebound, and Murray just about had it. Deathman just about gets his pocket picked. <laughs> <laughs> and Solberg up smiling. He knows he got had on that. Beautiful for on the left side, back up and in for two. And we're gonna get uh, like Murray. Something Murray. happened. I'm not quite sure. That's his. His left elbow was bothering him. That was earlier in the first half, and it looks like that's what kind of he's holding yeah. now. So Salvolo will come in. Pilgrim with it. Crosses Erickson over his drive up and no good. Klein with the board. Klein picks up his dribble, gets it back to Butikofer. That's Charles. Over to the left side now is Erickson. Erickson drives into the paint, passes off to Klein on the right side, shot up, no good. Rebound, lean. Lean goes up against Sanders. Sanders comes away with it. Yeah, boy, good position by Hunter Sanders. That's his third block. He's, He's a good defensive player. He is a very good defensive player. Stentoff with it. His drive. Boy, he got hammered. <laughs> He's probably wishing he hadn't brought that ball back down. He went up between two long guys, and he faked it up, got both arms to come down, and he got absolutely whacked across the face. Erickson with the foul. Boy, in the NBA, they'd go take a look at that and call that a flagrant. <laughs> right? <laughs> yeah. And, uh, Mr. Creek Stepped agrees off. with me there. Yeah, there was, there was malicious intent on both of those defensive players. First free throw, no good from Stentoff. Uh, he gets a second one here. Second one's up and in. good. Vision must have cleared a little bit there. He's still kind of shaking his head. Here's Erickson now. The Savage Warrior player over to Detman on the right-hand side. Detman drives into the paint, layup up and no good. I know. He's oh, turned he cold. Rebound put back by Charles. Yeah, good job by Stantop looking ahead. Pilgrim, not sure if he ever came down to play defense, but he was definitely behind the defense. And quick two there brings it to 80 to 45, There's 17 Char minutes to go. Charles on the right side. Bounce pass to lean at the low post. Erickson, top of the key, quick three-point shot up. Too hard off the back of the iron. Rebound, Sanders, outlet pass goes to Pilgrim. Yeah, good job of getting it out quick. And Pilgrim over to Stentoff, thought about the three. He'll drive, floats a pass to Solberg, gets it over oh, yeah, Deathman, yeah, yeah. boy. Carson Solberg didn't have much clearance, but he did get it over Deathman. So slowly chipping away. Erickson now on the right side. Erickson. Over to Charles on the right side, shot no good. Rebound, Sanders. Sanders is taking a beating down there. Yeah, Stentoff with it, going up, and blocked well, by Erickson. If he wouldn't have put the elbow out at the yep. guy, he'd have made it. Agreed. Klein with the layup, no good. Lean with the putback, and he goes to the line for two. Yeah, it is, boy, concerted effort by uh, Austin Lean, Hunter Sanders, boy, attacking that rebounds. And, boy, both guys are working really, really hard, and... Lean rewarded with a chance at some free throws here. There it goes. Rolled out. Fleckinger and Fast Horse in. Detman to take a break. Well, hard to believe we're uh, four and minutes Charles. in the second half and he has not scored. Lean at the line for his second shot. And swoosh. And Hagen's going to come in for Lean. So well deserved break for Austin Lean. And a little smaller lineup now for the white team. Yeah, the blue team was talking about what they're doing on defense, but uh, they're the ones with the ball on offense. So Pilgrim doesn't take the screen from Stentoff. Set cross court to Sanders. He'll drive on Hagen. Boy, got too far into the basket. Gives it to Solber. Corner three. That's no good. Sanders another rebound. Good pass to Salvador. Oh, nice move. Boy, and Hunter Sanders, Great vision, wasn't selfish, gave it the easy basket to Salvable. That's one thing I have not seen 
anybody uh, that wasn't willing to give off a shot. Right. Shot by Erickson is three for two, for three. Well, he gave a jab step, got some space, and then buried it. Stentoff with it. He's guarded by Fast Horse. Crosses over his drive. Hagen was there. <laughs> Fast Horse play. Yeah. I think one official called foul and one's calling out a foul. They are going to get Fast Horse with the foul. So Stentoff will go to the line. 85-50 is your score. 15-24 to go here in the second half. <coughs> First one up from Stentoff is good. Me Budico for coming in for Pilgrim. So Sammy Budico for into the game. Another free throw for Stentoff. That one is up, and that one is also good. And Arnson's going to come in for Stentoff. Here comes Erickson for the white team. Brings it to center court. Left side, Flickinger. Flickinger hands off to Fast Horse. Hagen, left wing, waiting for the cutter. And Flickinger underneath, bounce pass out to Klein, up and in for two. Well, I like that play from Flickinger. He recognized he, he didn't run all the way out to where he had a lane for that shot. Made the good pass as Budokover passes out to Arnson. Arnson trying to get around Fast Horse. And uh, Fast Horse pressure forces that turnover. Erickson now with the ball, stolen by Sanders. And good job of Sanders keeping his eyes up but not forcing the pass as Budokover brings it up. Great cut by Sanders, gets it over to Salvable, and that's twice Hunter Sanders has drawn the defense and found his fellow post player. Very unselfish. Layup. But those are winning plays. Yeah. In an all-star game, it doesn't matter who wins this game. That's right. But regular season, as Hagen takes it, shot and misses, those are the plays that are the difference in winning a game and losing a game. Right. Solberg with it from Salvo over to Arnson. His three on the way is going to be short. And boy, I thought Salvo had a chance for it. And they're going to say it's off the line. got in the, ro in the road of it. <laughs> Uh, Budikover drops it out. Well, here's someone telling Solberg to shoot it. He kind of smiled over. They said, look who's guarding you. It's like, well, I mean, he and Flickinger, he's a little taller than Flickinger, but about the same size. So, <laughs> Flickinger down to Fast Horse. Fast Horse, left side, three-point shot, no good. Hagen with the rebound. Erickson now. Oh, that's fast that's stolen that's by Salvold. Salvo on the drive, live up. Boy, Budikover, I think he was kind of trying to pass it to Budikover. And <laughs> Budikover missed both. He had two chances. Boy, and Hagen stepped out of bounds trying to make the pass to Flickinger. I think Salvo tried to set up an oop off the backboard as he was smiling at Budikover. <laughs> threw it just a little too hard. Boy, that would have been something to see. Salvo on the drive, stops on a dime and <laughs> banks it in. Boy, Klein thought he was going to keep going. Good job of keeping that pivot foot down by Salvable. Klein just went by. Yeah. Erickson, fast horse on the left side now. Fast horse, right side. Erickson, three point long, in and out. Oh, look. Too much good. spin. Hagen with the rebound. Gets it to fast horse. Fast horse, now to Klein. Klein, top of the key. Drives against Peter Kofer. Into a double team, loses control. Boy, Erickson, when he let that go, it <laughs> looks good. It just had that spin on it, though. It did. Well, they need 13 points in three minutes to get to 100. <laughs> well, they'll make it. 56. Ball comes out the flick, Conjur. Oh, nice deal by Solberg. A good defense by Flickinger, and by oh, Budakofer! Missed the first one, gets his own rebound. They call that stat padding where I'm from. <laughs> Could have very easily made the first one. Fast horse, gets it over to Hagen. Now Flickinger. Flickinger, wide open lane, tries to go in, loses it. And Boy, he beat Solberg <laughs> the basket, but Arnson came from behind it. So I mean, you see Flickinger just gritting as he's sprinting up and down. Salvable shot, no good. Rebound to Erickson, but Boy, Flickinger come out of there smiling, sticks his tongue out of Solberg. He says, do you know I got you, even though someone bailed you out. Erickson over to Hagen on the right wing. Steps in, long two, no short. 
They didn't want to shoot the three for whatever reason. It took the heart too. Salvavold on the drive spins, shot up and rolls out. Budukofer tried to get it. Saved by Hagen right to Salvavold. He gets it, to, well, what the Sanders into Arnson and Arnson puts it off the glass and in. So up to 60 points now. They've cut the lead to 27, 87-60. Here's Flickinger now. Gets it over to Hagen. Hagen drives into the paint. Gets the ball stripped by Budikofer. And Budikofer leading the charger. Gets it to Arnson. Three on the way is good. good. Boy, it's not a quick release, but Arnson gets his feet set, gets his arms under him, and makes a really good-looking shot. And we got a timeout called, I believe, by Coach Stepler. 87-63, and I mean, let's be honest, stranger things have happened. <laughs> so we got a full one minute timeout. So I'll tell you what, been impressed with the athleticism uh, from all these guys. Well, you see uh, Thomas Arnson getting up, he's blocked a couple of shots. Uh, there is nothing no. guaranteed in this game if you drive to the basket. So, and these, you know, some of these shorter players are playing bigger than they are. Very much so. But, and you can see they're enjoying it. They're competing hard. And uh, again, like we talked about in the girls game, an awful lot of skill out there. I mean, 63 points is, is nothing to, to sneeze at. Uh, it's just that someone went for 30 in the first half and got his team up to 70 yeah. and a half. So, right. I mean, you think about it, well, it was 71-37, and in the second half... And we got a 24-point... 20, a 26-16 to 16, uh, start to this half yeah. for uh, Team Blue. Now they got the big team back in for the white. Samuel goes up, tries to shoot it, uh, hits off the rim. By looking for I a, think they were looking for Detman to go. Yeah, they were he looking for a dunk off the inbounds. And, and uh, Cover goes up, and he's fouled. Boy, Hunter Sanders played that perfectly. It was just unfortunate that that ball hit the rim. Yeah. So Budikofer will go to the line here as uh, Deathman and Salvable uh, exchange some pleasantries. They're both, you know, right talking about that last one. Hey, that'd have been cool if you'd have dunked that. Yes. Hunter Sanders was not going to let that happen if he if he'd have met. Uh, Sanders would have picked it off, I think. Oh, if it doesn't hit the rim, yeah, Sanders has that all day long. Yeah. Second shot now coming for Budikofer. First one's no good. Second one goes in. So Sanders gets it in to Budikofer. Sammy with it coming up the floor. He's guarded by brother Charles. Hands off to Sanders, top of the key. He's guarded by Lean. Over to Arnson, picked up by Fastors. Arnson around the screen, tries to turn the corner. He gets cut off over to Solberg, fake the three. Over to Salvavold. Pump fakes on Deathman. Can't get around him, boy. Deathman is super long. Arson with on the drive. Fading away, boy. That oh. was a pretty looking oh, nice. shot. Yes, fast horse. Fast horse gets the re re rebound. Now down to lean. Shot no good. It's tied up. Boy, and Sanders just about had the block. Lean did a great job of getting into Sanders' body so he couldn't jump as much. Tie-up's going to go to Team White here with 11 minutes left. Budikofer gets it into Detman. Detman, top of the key. Steps back, long two, short. Saved from going out of bounds by Budikofer, but it's picked off by Salvavold. Between the legs pass right to Salvavold, and Lean gets Budikofer, but can't get the rebound. Salvavold out to Budikofer, three on the way is no good. Fast horse with the rebound. Gets it away from Sanders. Now here's Budikofer. Dribbles over to the right side, drives in, low post, layup, chop, no good. And Solberg with it, gets up ahead to Budikofer. Driving on lean, spins, layup, no good. Boy, tough shot, rebounded by Charles Budikofer. Charles gets it to Detman. Detman, and he travels, going in for the layup. We can, <laughs> we're not, we're not going to count it. No, nope, drug the foot. So, uh, still stuck on 31 points, which let's be honest, that's a career game for the majority of all humans on the planet. Exactly. But, uh, so, Arnson with it. He drives on fast tour. Shot up, no good. Good defense by Jared. Charles with the rebound. He's guarded by brother. 
by Sam. Down to Flickinger. Flickinger on the left side. Now to Detman. Detman on the right side. Shot up and good for two. And there he gets one to go. He, he had been leaving everything short. Maybe a little bit of pressure getting to him, but also fun to watch. <laughs> shouldn't, have shouldn't have told him. I guess. I didn't tell him. I told his coach. Solberg's three on the way. That one's no good, and no one's going to get to that long rebound. It's really interesting to watch fellow teammates guard each other. You have brothers from Bainville guarding each other, and then watching Carson Solberg and Landon Flickinger has been really interesting. Very good. Yep. The, uh, the smiles and the little jabs <laughs> and the, the sticking the tongue out. You can tell they're enjoying this game immensely. That's what this is for. Lean, three point from the right side, short. Oh, he just faded away a little bit or he had it. So here comes Solberg with it. Nice pass to Budico for buying Oh everybody. my gosh, what a nice play. So 90 to 65 is your score and they didn't get to 100, Tim. No, they, no. Charles with the under the bucket shot up and good for two. So it looks like we got Klein and Stentoff ready to check back in at the next break. Arnson with it. Trying to go underneath the Sanders, picked off by Detman. Detman, pass over to Flickinger on the left side. Flickinger loses it to Sanders. Yeah, he left his feet, didn't have many options. Solberg with it. Boy, he takes the shot. I think he thought someone was going to come out to get him and was left all alone, and that shot just a little to the right. Fast horse tries to go down oh, underneath, oh. missed. <laughs> yeah, yeah he, he was looking for the alley-oop, and uh, Deathman says, I, I'm tall, but I ain't that, that, that My tall. bad, I wasn't, wasn't ready. <laughs> so another turnover here as uh, Stentoff's going to bring it up. 8.40 to go. Hands off to Pilgrim, who's back in the game. His three on the way is no good. Good looking shot just off the front iron, and Lean comes up with another rebound, and he's going to bring it. Guarded by Sanders and Budakofer. He gets it ahead to Deathman, splits the defense, layup up and good. Left hand layup for Deathman. And Pilgrim back up with it. Up to Budakofer. He's followed by Lean. Boy, up and down we go. A little stoppage of play here. Boy, and Solberg thought maybe he was going to get uh, Deathman on that last one. To me, the third foul on number five, Austin Lean. As Sammy Budokofer steps to the line for one. Free throw up and no good. Rebound to Klein. Hands off to Charles. Charles down court to Lean on the right side. Three point shot, short again. And Solberg with it. Sit up ahead to Stentoff. Stentoff steps in the left hand at three. That's good. So Nate Stentoff, fresh off the bench, comes in and nails a shot. Gets him up to 70. 94 70 is your score. 750 to go. Deathman now with the ball. Tries to go up. <laughs> yeah, I say, there's one official let it go, but he definitely got smacked on the back of the hand, and he'll get some free throws here. Now, will he shoot him right-handed or left-handed is the question. <laughs> And the foul was on Pilgrim. Pilgrim, okay. That's only two on him. Right-handed free throw is up and rattles in. And Hagen and Erickson coming in for Flickinger and Lean. Referee County noses. That went up and good. That's 37, I believe, now. Down court, pass, oh! Solberg wasn't expecting it. Uh, Pilgrim thought he had him open in the corner, and uh, you do have to float it up pretty high to get it over Mason Desmond, but I don't think either player saw that ball coming. Right. Here's Erickson now for the white team. Going to stop the key over to Hagen on the right side. Hands off to Detman. Detman steps back, three-pointer short. Off the glass, gets his own rebound. Fakes it up. Second shot, short again. Well, Gets his rebound yeah. again. He's just kind of aiming instead of shooting the ball. Hagman, Hagen, turn around shot underneath, is up and good for two. Yeah, you can tell he kind of forced the issue yeah. a little bit. Stentoff with it, he's going to stop and transition. His three no good. Tipped out by, well, they're going to say it's going to stay. Well, up oh, they're going to call blue. Yeah, they are calling blue. I, I, I'm with Mr. Hagen. I think that was swatted out by Budico. Uh, yep. So, 98 Budico. to 70 here is blue inbounds. Pilgrim on three. 
That's no good. Deathman tried to get it. Ends up in Pilgrim's hands. Pass over to Budakofer, and he's blocked by two, his brother and by Deathman. So Charles and Mason combine on the block, and all right, Charles, Charles lost it and then comes out with it. Coast to coast, finger roll, no good. Stentoff with it. <laughs> Slows it down now. We got 6.42 left, 98. Sober, catch and shoot, no good. And now blue team just kind of chucking away Charles here. Charles with it now, hands off to Erickson. So a chance to break that 100 point barrier here as Erickson step back three, no good. Sober with the rebound. Outlet pass. Yeah, Stentop with it. Well, he had Sanders for a second. Back out to Budokover. Sammy Budokover's three is short. Rebounded to Hagen. Gets it to Deathman. Up to Erickson. Oh, oh he was looking for it. He threw it up the wrong side. <laughs> and Pilgrim having all kinds of trouble. Just hanging on to the ball here. Gets it to Sanders. Over to Solberg. Corner. He thought about the three. Budakofer had it for a second. That was Samuel. It's poked away by Charles. Oh, yep. Boy, Solberg was looking for a second three over Deathman. And uh, Arntzen and Salvavold are going to check back in for Sanders and Solberg. And I think it looks like Noah Murray sounds like he may be dislocated that elbow and he's going to be done for the night. Yeah. Bounce Good pass in his stent door. Boy, stent off, faked it, went back door. Nice pass and play. Det 98 72. Here's Detman now. Detman gives it to Klein in the paint. Shot up, no good. Rebound put back by Charles. Yeah, Charles kind of just overhead passed it towards the basket. That wasn't even really a shot. As Budico for lost. Here's Erickson gets it ahead to Detman for the dunk. Hey. Nice unselfish play, and there we hit 100 on Deathman's third dunk of the night. 5.20 to go. 100 to 72 is your score. As Pilgrim brings up, hands off to Stentoff, guarded by Klein. Couple of fakes, tries to spin, finds Arnson. Shot on the way from three, misses everything. Boy, if it had been on line, it was good. Now Klein. Klein for the white team. Comes in. Hagen. Hagen went to shoot and it slipped out of his hands and went right to Klein. Klein put back is up and in for two. Boy, and Hagen just laughing there because he went up for a legitimate shot and the ball shot straight out right into the defense. Arson with it, guarded by Erickson. Couple of dribbles, hands off to Salvo, looking to drive on Hagen, gives off to Pilgrim, and Sanders gets set to check back in. Steal by Klein if he can get a hold of it. He does, it picks it up. Gets it to Hagen. Hagen. Over to the left side, beautiful for a shot up and in for, they giving him three or two? They're giving him three. The official from all the way back to the other side of the court as Arnson gets it up ahead to Salvable. And boy, Hagen wasn't gonna let him dunk. Salvable looked at him and says, hey man, like what the heck, you're up by 30. Let me have my dunk. And Hagen says, not on me, guy, not on me. Boy, that is Ch deep, boy. Uh, <laughs> stepped across the line Yeah, launched it. Four minutes left, and uh, you know, there you go. All right. Deathman's going to take a seat, and I wonder if that might be it for him. Uh, heck He's of a got night. 39. Still, I mean, 31 in the first half, and you know, I know we joked about 50, but still a heck of a game for Mason Deathman as he takes a seat here with four minutes to go. Stentoff with it. He's going to pull up in transition. That three. Nice good. shot. Boy, a nice looking shot from Nate Stentoff. And that's twice he's pulled up and buried in transition. Fast towards the other way. Oh, and he'll do it too. Boy, good looking shot from him as well. Stentoff with it again. He's going to pull up on Flickinger. Is it two in a row? No. Halfway down. In and out. Charles with the rebound. Charles. Over to lean, top of the key, three-point shot, short. Put back up by Charles, is up and in for two. Yeah, and lean just needs to get his feet set a little bit. He's kind of fading away, not getting everything on it. So, like to see him make one here in final game here in Lambert. Boy, another long three. This one is good. By Sam. Yeah, Sam would go for Mike when he goes home, say, hey, Charles, remember that time you <laughs> shot the long one and missed, and I made it? <laughs> no. Over to oh. Fast Horse. Fast Horse on the right wing, shot up, no good. Rebound comes down to Sam. Hands off to Stentoff. A good hands by Charles. 
Picked Klein up by Klein. Yeah, good defense there. You know, Klein's been a workhorse out yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, he's done all the, the little things, the dirty work on the inside, <laughs> getting the steals and rebounds. Fast horse pulls up, up and in for two. Boy, a tough shot there. And another good shot from Fast Horse. He's another young player. Be fun to watch. Oh, it will be the next three years with him. Arnson hands off to Sanders. Gets it into Salvable through the double team. Yeah, look. Klein knocks him down. Chance for a three-point play for Richard Salvable. And it's not too often in high school that you see a team score 82 points and be losing by 30. 30. Yeah. So, uh, yeah, run up on almost 200 total points here. Salvo's free throw, that one is no good. Rebounded by Budikofer. Charles now brings it up on the left side. Here comes Budikofer. Lean on the left wing, three-point shot, no good. Rebound by Flickinger. <laughs> he tried to, oops, I've stepped out. Just out. about <laughs> saved her. Good hustle from Landon. Boy, they're trying to get Lean a three-pointer and... That time he just put a little too much on it as he and Hunter Sanders share a laugh. And boy, 2.17 left, and uh, Arnson playing it out here, letting the ball roll to half court before he picks it up, can serve a little time here. Hands off to Budico for guarded by his brother. Charles guarding Sam, gets back to Arnson. Arnson's drive cut off by Klein, but he spins through, shot no good, and Salivold tips out Flickinger. Boy, he had the smallest guy going against the biggest guy, and. Uh, Bodies collide, and well, Flickinger didn't win the battle. He uh, he gets the ball. So Flickinger Oops. with it. Klein on the right side. He tries a long three. Oh, oh, off the glass, in and out. Up ahead to Arnson. Gonna push the pace. Hands off to Sanders. Sanders over to oh, the left nice side. Nice pass to Arnson. Boy, almost a knuckleball shot. Here comes Klein. Are they going to let him dunk it? No, oh, he's not even going to take. But oh, the putback by good Charles ball. was good. Yeah, he, I really wish he'd have got up just an inch higher and put it down. I mean, it's a nice follow. Don't give me a Oh, yes, step. yes. But Deathman would have had both arms inside the rim. Yes. <laughs> so Stent's up with He's going to walk it up. Minute 25 to go. Step back three on the way is no good. Good hustle play by Budakofer as Samuel gets in for a rebound in two. 114-84 is your score. Here's Fast Horse, Brockton Warrior player. Shot up at the half court, no good. Line. Yep, you gotta take it here at this stage of the game. Yep. Budakofer with it, he'll pull up from three. That's no good, rebound to Budakofer. Gets ahead to Fast Horse. Damn. Yeah, I'm not gonna dog him too much, but that's very anticlimactic with under a minute to go to make the layup. <laughs> Dunk it or shoot the long one. Oh, they want Sanders for it. Lean took a hard step just to mess with him. Sam shot up, <laughs> deflected. Yep. His brother Charles looks up and says, I got you again. Bounce pass underneath to Flickinger, up and in for two. I feel like they're pushing to get 120. Here. Sanders up at the Budico for are they going to go and dunk? No. Yeah. Boy, he makes it. Boy, Klein got up and got a part of it. Here's Flickinger. We got 25 seconds left. Flickinger hands off to Klein. Three point shot is away and in. Boy. Boy, shot clock never reset for anything. <laughs> so here we go. Salvable with it. They're going to let him dunk. Oh, well. Hey, he, lost, call it that. he lost the ball, grabbed the rim, snapped it, and the ball fell through. So <laughs> here's Klein. Now to Charles. Charles tries <laughs> to dunk up and in for two. There we go. Well, <laughs> it kind of got to a little bit of showmanship at the end, but your final score, the white team 123, the blue team 88. Uh, great time for all. I, yeah. <laughs> so. Well, we'll do some. All right, give a big hand to these guys that put on quite a show. <laughs> Remember, if He's you want to get some pictures, it'll be down underneath. The flag, your MVP of the boys' Pepsi Juicy All-Star game, Mr. Mason Detman, congratulations. Mason Detman is the MVP for, for the game tonight. Another big thank you to the sponsors, the referees, and the coaches, and also you parents for the work you put in with your players. Safe travels tonight. Thank you, everyone. We'll see you next year. Any other messages you got now? You you fill them in. Say that again. 
What did, who was the MVP? Oh, uh, Mr. Mason Deathman, which you kind of knew after the first half that he had. Uh, you know, kind of fitting. He's He's been arguably the best player in the district the last couple of years. I remember watching him as an eighth grader coming up, and you knew he was going to be special. And, and and not in an arrogant way either. No. Know, he makes his teammates better. Uh, you saw that through his play with Freud Medicine Lake, and you saw it here tonight as well. Uh, he was willing to make passes, set up his team in a good way, and uh, a great way to go out, end his high school career as he gets ready to transition to MSU and play some football for them. So a uh, great game again. Obviously not very close. i got to catch Rocky here. Hey, oh. Rocky. Come back up wow. here, Coach. I was telling we got a couple of the high school kids coming to play, in, but I told them to make And we're sitting here doing our uh, our stats, so just hang on, folks. We're a little slow here. We're getting there. All right. I'll give these stats over to my helper. I'm my, not, you're not my assistant. You're not my helper. What? You're, you're my partner. Right. Okay, here. Sorry, do, the, Rocky. do the blue. Oh, I see how it is. That's, that's to get me to do some work here. Yeah, so in uh, in a losing effort, and again, not too often you see a team score almost 90 and lose by 30, but uh, the blue team, valiant effort here, uh, led by Mr. Samuel Budakofer. He came off the bench, uh, seven field goals, two three-pointers, oh, one from the free throw line. He ends with 20. Nate Stentoff, boy, he shot lights out from the three-point line there in the second half. Hit four threes. Three or four from the free throw line, a couple more field goals. He ended with 19. And then Mr. Hustle, Bridget Salvavold, he had the unenviable task of guarding Mason Deathman for part of the game. He finished with seven field goals and 14 points. Also in double figures, Carson Solberg, he hit a three ball, a couple other field goals, two or four from the free throw line. Uh, getting in on the scoring, Thomas Arnson, he had kind of got a, off to a hot start early in the game. He ends with seven, two field goals and a three pointer. Uh, Hunter Sanders with four, Zane Pilgrim with four, and looking for, oh sorry, you have Jared Pass, never mind, I missed it. So yeah, Hunter Sanders and uh, Zane Pilgrim, <laughs> teammates from Savage, they both end with four points. Uh, so it looks like we had six, nine three-pointers made for the blue team. Free throw line, five made free throws on 10, 16 attempts. So five of 16 from the free throw line. Uh, and again, final score. Oh, I gotta do a little math here. 350. <laughs> <laughs> I think it was 88. 123 to 88, I believe, was the final. So 88 points again. Uh, really, I mean, most coaches in a 40 minute game would take 88 points. So uh, just unfortunately, the white team a little bit. A little bit more firepower there at the end, and Tim's about ready with the uh, the stats for Team White. So glad you were able to join us, those of you who made it out in person, and those of you listening, watching online. Uh, this is a great opportunity to see those athletes play one last time uh, for their high schools, represent their schools, represent their district. Uh, so look forward to doing this again next year. And big thank you to the sponsors. Uh, Pepsi, the Lions Den, thank you to the coaches for taking time out of their busy schedules to come and do this, the officials as well, and uh, yeah. All, all the volunteers, all the, volunteers and the, made the food here, the, the workers, and the people that came. Yeah, yeah, really good, really good crowd, so. Very good, we appreciate everybody that came out for this. Okay, I'm going to give you the rough stats for the white team. Landon Frickinger from the Plentywood Wildcats. He had one three-pointer, one field goal, two for two from the charity stripe. That gives him seven. We have Austin Lean from the RL Fusion. Our homeboy here, I'm sorry. Uh, he had three, three field goals, two for three from the charity line. That gives him eight. Ben Hagen from the Plentywood Wildcats. He had three field goals. That gives him six. Jared Fasthorse from the Buckton Warriors had four field goals along with three three-pointers, or two three-pointers. That gives him 14. Charles Bettecufer from the Bainville Bulldogs. He had nine field goals, one three-pointer, one for two from the charity stripe, so he had 22 points, so he did pretty good there. And uh, Chance Klein, he had uh, five field goals, one, two three-pointers, so that gives him 13. 
Sayer Erickson from the Savage Warriors. Two field goals, two three-pointers, 0 for 2 from the charity stripe. That adds up to 10 in my math. Mason Detman, seven field goals, five three-pointers, six for seven from the free throw line. Uh, I got 39 points for him. Yeah. And that's all we got. So 123 to 88. Is that what the world, what it says here? They shut their yeah. clocks off too fast. Yeah, yeah, it was 123 to 88. Okay. So just about. We're just about done. Hang on. So I have nothing else to say. Yeah. Unless you, we'll see you next year. See you next year. Yeah, it was great. Always fun to do this with you, Tim. Great yes, to it is. Get to, get to see the best that our district has to offer. And uh, I encourage you, if there's anyone from other districts listening, this is something great that uh, you should get started in yours because it really is a great way to send these kids off uh, to celebrate just the fun that they've had over the last number of years and, and one last chance to strap it up and get to play in a, in a low-pressure fun environment, get to play with kids that you've competed against your whole life, that you get yes. to be on a team with, play against some of your teammates, and, and just have an overall enjoyable experience. These kids, uh, they know everybody. You know, it's not like when I played. We didn't know that necessarily right. the other team other than, oh, that's that, they're, they're evil. Yeah. Yeah, <laughs> we no, got to beat them. These guys are all, these are all friends. Never, right, yeah, and you could see that on the floor. You know, and just, just enjoying each other's company and just having a good time. They want, they want everybody to succeed. Right. And so, anyway, we will sign off here. Thank you, John. You take Thanks. care. You do the same. Have a good summer. And you we'll see same. you in the grocery store, maybe. Oh, yeah. Yep. See ya. Thank you for listening to us. And good night. <laughs>